This Saturday kicks off the first annual Edgefield Arts with a Heart Market. It'll be highlighting local artisans, woodworks, local vendors in the Edgefield Town Square. Michelle Derrick and Rhonda Nowicki are uh, some of the organizers of the event, and they are with us here this morning. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for joining us here. Uh, this is the very first one, Edgefield Arts with a Heart Market. Tell us about how this came about. Um, Edgefield Arts with Heart was born out of necessity. Uh, through the years, I've done markets since 2010, and through the years I've seen several markets disappear, several craft shows disappear in the area. There's a lot of really great crafters out there that just need a place to go, um, just need a place to show what they have for sale. We're going to have woodworkers and potters and jewelry makers and crocheters. Um, we've got a lot of really great vendors. Um, all the examples of their work are on our Facebook page, so you can go and look at different vendors that are going to be there. Okay. All right, it sounds like a lot going on. You definitely want to head out there. The neat thing is this event is actually benefiting a nonprofit. Yes. Um, Michelle, tell us about that. Yes, so we are Hope for Hooves Rescue, and we are so honored because we were chosen as the first organization. Um, so everything that they collect for the vendor fees is going to go straight to um, Hope for Hooves. And Hope for Hooves was, um, we began in 2020, um, October of 2020. And over the years, we have developed a program called Resonating with the Rescues. And that is for children who have been either abused or it could be autistic children, children who their parents may be incarcerated or anybody really that needs healing. And so um, what we've decided to do with the funds that are coming from this market is where it's gonna go into a scholarship program so that children can come for free. Because currently we do have to charge, it's like $20 um, per um, event or per session. Um, but our goal is to be able to provide those services for free. So, And this event yeah. will uh, help with that, with uh, raising yes, the funds for absolutely. it. absolutely. Uh, Rhonda, this is the first market event, so uh, what can participants expect when they're coming down? The event's from 10 to 2? 10 to 2 at the Edgefield Town Square. Um, we are going to have entertainment from Mike Milhelm, and he's going to be playing throughout the day, as well as the um, Douglas Elementary Chorus is going to be there and the Mamie Maccabee Cloggers will be there. So we'll have entertainment throughout the day, but also she'll be bringing her mascot. Yeah. So peanut. that- um, you remember Peanut? I do remember Peanut. peanut. Yeah. yeah, Peanut will be there. He'll yeah. be there. But right now we've already got $555 just from vendor fees that'll go straight to her. So this is a totally different type of event than has ever been done in the CSRA. None of us are making any money. Um, it's all volunteers. We're all volunteering our time to make this happen, to help not only the community, but the vendors, to help the nonprofit, mm -hmm. to help the entertainers so that everybody can get out there. And how does that feel to know that you're not only hope helping this nonprofit organization, but you are helping the community and all of these local vendors that are taking part, helping get their name out there to the community? It, it's so important. Edgefield's mm -hmm. such a small place, but we have some great things mm -hmm. to offer. And we really just need a place mm -hmm. so that everybody can learn about, you know, like her organization. Mm -hmm. A lot of people, she's right here in Edgefield, mm -hmm. don't even know about her. So every month we're going to promote a different nonprofit um, to get that out there. Mm -hmm. And if you've not been to Edgefield, it is a lovely town square, right it in the is. center of town. Yeah. Uh, it is. Where can people go to get more information on Hope for Hooves? They can go to hopeforhooves.org. And we have a brand new website, so go check it out. <laughs> All right. And also online for the actual market event with this, this Saturday, where can people go for that information? Um, Facebook, um, it's Arts with the Heart um, on Facebook. Mm -hmm. And we ask people, please just share and let your neighbors know about it. Um, and come, come yeah. visit. Come support. Yeah. Come see Peanut. Come support. Yeah. Come see Peanut, but support local. Yeah. All right. We but, love it. But see Peanut. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Michelle, Rhonda, thank you so thank much. You. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it. Okay. Come